Good evening, I'm Jill Valley. More than 20 years ago, a train derailment spilled oil into Whitefish Lake. And now, boats from San Francisco Bay and Puget Sound are there to start to clean it up. Katie Harris takes us there. Sea vessels have arrived in Whitefish Lake to start cleaning up the aftermath of an oil spill from years ago. In 1989, Burlington Northern Santa Fe trains derailed, spilling petroleum oil into Mackinac Bay, leaving an oil sheen in that area. BNSF and the Environmental Protection Agency are teaming up to clean the contaminated sediments. The vessels are being launched into the lake for cleanup that starts at the end of this week. We intend to dredge out everything that'll, that was contaminated with the diesel from the original derailment event. And when it's all said and done, you know, Mackinac Bay will be a viable place for aquatic species to, to, to grow and thrive. If you're boating on the lake, you'll see tugboats and barges being transported to the boat launch. Tugboats will be pushing the barges across Whitefish Lake eight times a day round trip. And hopefully that means there won't be any recreational impact, or at least it'll be kept to a minimum. The crew will be using the west side of the dock to launch boats. That means the public will have to use the east side of the dock. The project should be finished by the 4th of July. In Whitefish, I'm Katie Harris for Montana's news station. And the crew plans to ship the contaminated sediment to South Dakota by train for careful disposal.